Hey everyone, in today's video, I wanna show you how to use this PS4 remote to play games on your iPhone. So now with iOS 13, there is a way to combine these two and connect this and use it as a remote controller. And if you have a PS4, you should already have one of these. And if you don't have one of these, you could pick one up. They have it on Amazon. I'll put a link in the description for it. And then you could use Bluetooth basically to connect the two. And if you have Apple Arcade, the $5 a month subscription to all of Apple's games in the arcade section, there's a whole bunch of games you could play using this. I'll show you where to find some of those games in the description of the game. And then I'll put a long list down below too to some of the games that you could use the remote control for to play on Apple Arcade. So first you wanna turn on Bluetooth on your iPhone if it's not turned on. So go to the settings app on your phone here, click Bluetooth and make sure it's on on top and all your Bluetooth devices will show up. The remote won't show up just yet. You have to do one other step. So in order to get the remote to show up, now that the Bluetooth is on, you have to press start and you have to press share at the same time. So the PS4 button right here in the center and the share, hold them at the same time for a few seconds here. And then you should see this blinking over here. And on the bottom, on their other devices, you see DualShock 4 wireless controller. If I select it, it will add it right here to my list of Bluetooth and it will be automatically connected. And you'll know it's connected when it turns red here. So just like that, you're ready to play any game that supports this. Now, I'm gonna show you also how to disconnect it. But before I do that, let's go to the arcade section. So I just connect to the app store here and the arcade icon on the bottom. And if you go to games, if you click on any game, I'll just randomly select one. And if you come down here to the support section, you could see that if it does use game controllers, it will tell you right here. So PlayStation and Xbox remotes right here are compatible with this setup. And let me show you now how to disconnect it. So if you're not gonna use it, I recommend you disconnect it. Again, come to your Bluetooth. This time we're gonna come on top here and you see that Bluetooth icon, we're gonna press and hold on it. And right now it's connected to our Bluetooth wireless remote. We're gonna go ahead and select it again by holding it down. And I wanna just press DualShock 4 wireless remote one more time and it's gonna disconnect it. And we could jump back into our menu here if we wanna forget this device altogether here. You just press I and then forget device, and then forget device and it'd be gone completely from your Bluetooth list. But I hope you could utilize this to play your favorite arcade games on your iPhone and your iPad. So I'm gonna link in the description to some of my favorite games. There's gonna be a long list there so you can pick and choose instead of exploring the arcade store. But I hope you found this useful. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more how-to videos just like this one. And I'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching.